a wanted man running a training camp on the Kenya-Somalia border. Sheikh Hassan Turki has evaded capture by the transitional government and its allies since the Islamic Courts Union was ousted. He is also wanted by the United States and Kenyan governments. The main accusation that he was involved in the bombings of the U.S. embassies in Nairobi and Dar es Salaam in 1998. He denies any wrongdoing. These are malicious allegations. I was not part of any of these plots. There are tensions with Kenya because the existing regime is an agent of the U.S. We advise the Kenyans to change this regime in the next elections. At Sheikh Hassan's camp, the small group of fighters trained for the battles they say await them in Mogadishu. An Al Jazeera cameraman was shown the targets being used by the militia. Posts bearing the names of leaders considered to be their enemies. We are at war. The South is the center of the battleground where fighters are trained and equipped for battle. We plan operations from here and continue our fight against the occupiers. For now, Sheikh Hassan is resolved to continue his activities in the bush. It is what is fueling the resistance in Mogadishu. And that is what he and his men say they live for. Ahmed Ado, Al Jazeera.